Hello everybody, this is Discount Dad, and we are just about to boot up episode 11 of this Let's Play of Galactic Civilizations 3. We are playing as the Iridium Trade Empire, a uh, galaxy-spanning trade organization who's trying to take on militarily some of the other more traditional empires. In our last uh, couple of sessions, we have been on a two-front war with the Terrans and the Drath Empire, both of our neighbors. Uh, the Terrans, we've pretty much defeated and taken almost all of their planets. And we're working on doing the same with the Drath right now. Um, we're still a ways away from totally wiping them out, but we're doing a good job and we are spreading spreading out. Um, our next highest priority job is we're going to come in here and we're going to start taking out these Terran uh, star bases to get, to get these resources for ourselves. So let's see what we're doing this round. We are, as you see, slipping in the military rank. Um, it looks like we're in first place currently with production and research, but our military is, is flagging. So I'm happy we got those extra planets. Uh, those are going to be really helpful. And we're also sending out our trade ships. Uh, because of the way our, uh, what do you call them, ideology is set up, we get big bonuses from trade that other, gal other species don't get. So it's, I think it's worth it for us to take the extra push. All right, let me see. I got a rail two here and a rail one there. Let me see, should I send this guy in? Yeah, let's send him this way to, to fight there. And then I'm going to bring another ship around to start taking out these star bases. All right. Okay, a freighter. Yep, coming from Earth. Good. And where is it? Where is Earth? All right, here's the freighter. All right, and then so we're just looking for other giant worlds. Altaria, these guys are a large uh, country, so that might be a good one to go for. Who are these guys? The two triangles, what what race is that? Oh, I haven't even met them yet. Okay, well that's who I'm trading with. Let's get the some diplomacy set up with the last race that we haven't met. All right, where are they going? They're going up there to contact the Drath. And where is the other human world? There must be one Terran world left somewhere, I believe. Let me see. Okay. Okay, is there one where I can check planets? Population. Humans, they still have a population, but it's not big. Hmm. General power. Okay, we've taken a good lead in power. As long as we can keep up, then we'll be in good shape. All right, shipyard is idle. Which one is that? Iridia. Okay, so this is my main base. I'm actually going to build a possibility engine here. I know I said I was going for the other stuff, um, but I definitely want a little bit more resources coming out. Okay, let's see. Could he take out... Okay, the gunships cannot take out the uh, star bases by themselves. So I'm going to bring him in here. I want to take these star bases out. And it's apparently going to take a couple of turns to do it. Okay, and where is the remaining human? All right, let's send him down here. It could be could be this way. I'm actually going to have them wait. It would be I think it would be more worthwhile to completely eliminate humanity from the map than to head up there already. So I'm just going to pull them back here. Okay, and we're just going to give it one turn. Okay, let's see. And Droman, where is Droman? Is that these guys? Yeah. Okay, they built a rail. The, this rail I'm going to send up here. The rails aren't very powerful. They can't do a lot on their own. Let me see. All right, first let's save the game here. Discount Empire 11. Okay, so we save. All right. And now let me see here. That's a rail mark two. Do I have a rail mark one? Yeah, let's see, upgrade. Let me see, Do I? where is the rail mark two? Now I thought I could upgrade all of them from here. Let me see, upgrade. Hmm. All right, well I'm gonna have to look into how we get everybody to upgrade at once. Let's see here. All right, let's see. What do I have? He's got six two two. 
Okay, so all of that upgrade would only be to give two extra kinetic energy. Not really worth it for, uh, I mean, I need to do it eventually, but I think I might wait a little longer until I see what kind of weapons these guys are dealing with. Right, let's see that rail mark two. Bring this guy in here. Okay, and what does he have? A colony ship and a missile boat. Okay, that missile boat's actually, so these guys are dealing uh, with missiles. Let's see if the rest of them are like that too. Okay, took that out, draft this four. It's a dead world, not really worth my time. Ooh, this is their capital. Oh, and I can't make it this turn. Okay, darn, I guess I should have captured that this turn. That's okay. All right, let's see, soul. So this is my earth. Okay, so I'm going to build this, since I know that he's attacking with missiles. I'm going to build another gunboat. Actually, I'm going to build another possibility engine. I'm just going to take a quick couple of turns to build some uh, star bases around here that are boosting these worlds. This one is a, a production one. Okay, yeah. So I might go with an economic one instead. Just take a turn or two. I'm not going to spend too long building star bases around all these worlds, but a, a little bit of time might be worthwhile. And then where's the starbase mining this? Oh, there. Okay, yeah, I need to take those guys out too. Right, let's send this guy down. Oh, he's out of out of juice. Okay, fair deal. Pulse cannons. It's an 11 turn thing in exchange for six antimatter. Open borders. Fleet logistics. What a joke. No thanks. All right, let's see. Let's talk about something else. Should I offer them... It's, it was starting to cost 8 credits to get them to like me. I'm still making 103 per turn, so I'm doing good. Uh, let's see, I've got a, a level 5 aquatic world here. And let's see, what do they focus on? None of these worlds have a star... St oh, okay, he's building a shipyard. Plus 25% uh, tourism. This is a good world. Uh, I'm going to need a city here. Yep, yeah, okay, good. I've got one building. I think I'm going to... these. So worlds like this, I don't want them to be focused on... Like, you know, this seems like it would be a good one to focus on income, but it's just so close to the border. I'm going to put the focus on those on, uh, on manufacturing, just because I want ships close to the edge. These guys, though, it might be time to switch them to uh, research. They're so far from the front. Let's see here. Yeah, plus 25% research. All right, let's start switching things over, actually. Farm. Do they need a farm? Do I have a city building? Colonial hospital. I don't think I need stuff like this. Oh, it's almost done. So it is what it is, I guess. Okay. Colonial hospital, planetary... Well, uh, let's see. Ship construction. Do cities boost construction? They do. Okay. So that's a fine place for it. Although this would boost population. Okay, so I'm going to cancel... I'm going to put the city here when it's ready. All right. I think I'm wasting time doing these in this order, but I think it's fine for now. Okay, now these guys, though. What are they building? Colony capital and soil upgrade. Okay, after this, I think I'm going to start switching some of these planets over to, uh, to more research focus. They're just so far. Or maybe, maybe income. What do they have? Uh, he doesn't really have anything. Might as well go for research here. It's pretty far from the front. I believe Vallis is already... Colony Capital Soil Engineering. Okay, so I don't really have anything going on in this world yet. Plus two population. Why did they put a factory here on the population thing? Hmm. That's a terrible place for it. Okay. But for now, we're going to go with Research Labs. Approval is actually in good shape already. So let's go Research. Do I have any other good research things? Intelligence Agency. Uh, doesn't help. Port of Call, Starport, Strategic Command, Tech Capital. So that would be good if I could get some Arnor Spice. But I don't have it yet, so I'm just going to do that, and then we'll come back after that. This one, however, 
Uh, okay, I need one more stage of uh, terraforming because once I could put a planet here or something here, I'm going to put the uh, strategic command on there plus 50% ship construction. Okay, shipyard idle. Oh, did my... Is it this one? I thought I built a possibility engine here. Okay, done. Now, which shipyard is this? Down here? Okay, so he can't build anything very quickly. Let's see. Well, we might as well put in place another uh, possibility engine. We've got enough administration points that we might as well build some star bases now. Where's the soul? Okay. Let's start on a gunboat. Let's see, how do these uh, bases work? What am I looking at here? One, one, one. So they've got attacks of every type. So I actually, what's the difference between the gunboat Mark One and Mark Two here? Let me see if I can edit this one, design ship. Gunboat Mark One. I like that it's got all the shields. Can I just upgrade any of the weapons? Let me see, what do I have on for weapons? Enhanced laser and sparrow missile. Enhanced laser, sparrow missile does three damage. Stinger does two and three. Okay, it's pretty much already got the best weapons I've got. I wish there was a way to sort them by all of these without the categories. All right, I'm going to build that gunboat Mark I then. It's kind of an old-fashioned ship, but it's better for the broad... I do have a better laser now. Or maybe it's just got two lasers on it. All right, yeah, let's build some of these Mark Ones. Okay, end the turn. Ooh, 15% beam weapons. Oh, that was a, a low energy, not a, not a high-powered technology, so it wasn't quite as big of a boost as I would have liked. Okay. All right, let's see here. Yeah, let's bring these guys down. Still out of turns. Who is it? Oh, okay. No, oh, nobody's actually mining that yet. Okay, well, I got to build a uh, possibility engine right here and get that ascension crystal. Okay. Idle ship. Where's that? Okay. All right, let's send him down. These these guys are uh, scanners. They can investigate these capsules and anomalies and things like that to recover stuff. All right, idle ship. Where's that? Another one. Okay, let's bring him over here. The mining star base. Oh, getting those. All right, technology. Good. Okay, I got better better lasers. Right, and I don't know if I actually need this. Increase starbase range and award one free frigate. You know, I've already got quite decent range. Like, I mean, I, I don't have incredible range, but... Here we go. What do I have here? Shopping center. Hmm. All right. Boost yield of resources. That might be worth getting. Um, for now, let's let's keep working on armor rating plus 20%, armor cost minus 10%, or armor mass minus 20%. I'm going to go with that. I want more things on my ships, so I'm going to start going with uh, minimizing sizes for everything. Okay. What do I have? I've got a general. I've got two generals. Who are just providing passive three percent bonuses to defense. I've got one research scientist. Let's see, I don't have a like a main research capital yet, so I'm gonna leave him working here, three percent galaxy wide. Hmm. Is it worth building a spy now? Okay, my happiness is actually finally getting up there. 
War boosts all of my economy by 3%. Ship construction by 3%. Yeah, I'm going to go with ship construction. I don't think I have any of them yet. Let's see. Okay, do I have... Yeah, I've got a lot of miscellaneous ship construction, so I think I'm better off now leaving them work for the for the uh, empire rather than for a particular colony. Okay, let's end the turn. Let's see. I found an alien artifact. Okay, start. Took him out. Was that the draft capital? Where's my fleet? Right there. Dratha, that's the capital. Or maybe this was the capital. Okay, let's see, eject all. Oh, they ejected them to the wrong spot. Okay, quick battle, victory certain. What are those hypergates? Quick battle. And can I attack? Ooh. Let's see, battle advantage of 12 versus 12. Our forces are evenly matched. Oh, I see. The colors are just almost identical. Okay, so I've got five legions, but he's got 14 legions. Um, I don't think I want to do this 50% battle here. Okay, so I'm going to hold off on that fight. Let me see here. All right, yeah, that's that's too much. Research relic. Ooh, I, like, I like the sound of that. Now, what is this? Hmm. Okay. So for now, I think that's going to be too much to take. What did I get here on Drathus? Ooh. Oh, just a dead world. Okay. So that doesn't really do anything. Let me edit the sponsor. We'll take Drathus 4. It's not much, right? It, I, it only makes 4 military manufacturing, and it decays 27% because of the range. But it's better than nothing. I might as well take advantage of it while it's here. Um, and then let's just start upgrading. Yep, keep them all together. Okay. All right, we're just going to build... It's mostly a dead world, but it might be a little better once it, once we're done with it. Okay. Do I have two shipyards here? I do. I don't think I need both. I'll keep it. I'm not going to destroy it, but I don't think it's doing anything for me. Ooh, if I put a ship here, or a uh, colony here, starport, I could probably get the Ascension Crystal and the Research Relic. All right, idle ship. Where's that? Uh, send him up here. Okay, idle ship. It's only got one movement left. Let's send him back to this planet. We'll take it. We'll hold it. Okay, and I'm not going to be able to take... The Terran Alliance has been destroyed. Excellent. Who got him? All right, and now all of their things are gone. That means it's time for me to get my star bases up. So let me pull this ship back, this fleet. And then we're going to pull this fleet... We're bringing them up here to fight the draft. Did they go? Bringing them, bringing them there. Okay, it's going to be quite the drive, but I think it'll be worth it once we get there. Ooh, draft attack ship. What are they going for? With legions, three legions. Do I have anybody with weapons? Economic relic. I need that. Is it? Oh, it's being mined already. Darn. Okay. Ship with five move. Ship with six move. Does that one have five or six? Five. Okay. This little dud ship is not worth very much, but it's going to be good enough for this. So we'll send him out getting that guy. Okay. I don't know where he's going. Research. All right. Good. Armor upgrades. Right, let's see, let's go with the... Maybe I should go with a uh, planetarium bombardment. Let's see. Hmm. 
All right. In the meanwhile, we'll work on this. We're going to go with point defense again, reduction. Uh, doesn't matter how, how good we are. We can always use more stuff on our ships. Shipyard idle. We're building possibility engines now. We're going all, uh, all Starfleet or all build things for now. Okay. How far can I take this? All right, and then we're just going to build a star base here to boost these worlds. Construct star base. It's going to be an economic star base. All right, and so that allows us to build a oh, and a star base factory, star base market. Yep, happy for all of that. And then I don't know if it's worth the, f the five to build these. I am going to build those. Let's see. Hmm, influence growth. All right. Yeah, I'm not going to build too many weapons on it yet. It's still early. But five more interceptors. Okay. We'll just give it something. In the meanwhile, uh, we're doing plus 2.5% raw, raw production, 5% construction, 10% income on both these worlds. That's That's handy. Okay, let's just keep building more of those. Yeah. Okay, he's already building another one. Shipyard idle. You build one also. We're going to take a turn. We stepped up here in military might, so we're doing okay. A rail level one. Boy, that took a long time to build. Uh, that's barely worth it. Okay, so if this got two extra, it could contribute here. Cultural forum. That might be nice to have. In, in, uh, expand cultural influence. Might as well. Okay. Let's see. And then... Yeah, let's do scanners also. Okay. Okay. All right, and this one, how's he doing? I haven't checked in on these in a while. Okay, yeah, I'm giving these guys, these ones that are on the edge, I'm happy to spend some coins to upgrade. Okay, yeah, let's make that a more powerful ship, more powerful star base. Oh, I'm out of Durantium. So I'd need to build some of those. Uh... Yeah, I need to build some more... Uh, Mining colonies. Where is that guy going? Oh, that's a bad guy. How did that get in there? I don't think I can beat that ship. Yeah, he's a one, two, two, three. And I'm a six, six, two. I, I don't think I can beat him. These guys, though. All right, let's bring him around. Idle ship. Where's that? Okay, bring him down here. I don't think I need to build many more of these. Maintenance one. They're not, not doing a lot to help. Alright, let's see here. So this guy's got kinetic shields. But these ships, they uh, they find things, so they don't always stay the same. Alright, open borders. Missile augmentation. So two turns of augmentation. Uh, it's not enough research. Resource processing, growth, shield systems, xenoeconomics. I like that. He doesn't have anything that takes a lot of turns to develop. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm just going to deny it. Okay. Artifacts, what do I have here? Plus 500, per 500 points of shipyard production. That'll be good when I'm building like a really big ship. 25% damage on a single fleet. Okay, I don't have enough research to do that yet. Let's see. Nano fabricator on Drome in the first. Where is the nano fabricator? Oh, 
Gotta research it. Might as well. Alright. What is this thing? Plus two to tourism. Ooh, make this a wealth world. Let's see, research. But this does adjacency con construction. Okay. Let me see. Let's put this there. Okay. Because this, I want to take advantage of that research. All right. Build a Xeno lab. Okay. Turn. All right. Treasury. Not, not a bad find. Where did that... Is that the draft ship? Okay. Oh. Idle ship still. They have a deep space starbase. Uh, mining specialization. Black hole. Okay, so there's probably antimatter there. Idle ship. What do I have? The Illuminex. Go up there. Okay. Where's a, an idle shipyard? Ooh, did I build another possibility engine? Let's keep doing it for a little longer. Let's get this going. Uh, down here, I could get Ascension Crystal, Ascension Crystal, and Durantium, which is what I'm missing. That's kind of the big the big resource that I don't have. So let's bring him down here. And then I can do the research to extend his range, and I think I'll be able to pick both of those up with one. All right, and then I'm going to build a gunboat with the point defense, because I think the ones that we've been running into have had more missiles. Although we've got an approval relic. Nope, you know what? I want to grab that. So let me go back. Who did I just manage there? Hamster. Cancel that. Let's build a possibility engine. Okay, where is this hamster? These, those are these guys down here. Okay. All right, and have my ships renewed? Yes. Can they reach that guy? Oh, not quite. He survived. Gonna get lucky. All right, mysterious hardware. Alien computational system found in this capsule are so advanced that their survey team lacks the words to describe all but their most rudimentary functions. Okay. All right, let's see. Still not the next turn. Got an idle ship. Okay, I was right. That is uh, black hole stuff. All right, and then let's just keep this guy scouting. Might as well send him around to try to figure out what we're looking at with the draft here. Our military rank is still low. Idle ship? Who? Oh, okay. Send him up there. Experience points. What can I upgrade this guy to? Anything good? Ooh, one of my gunboats. A high-level gunboat. I'll think about it. For now, I'm happy having him be able to explore. And he's got quite good stats just from finding things. Let's send him out here. That's a weird, weird route to go. Let's go there. I don't mind flying through this space. Idle call or idle ship, an interceptor. Let's send him here. Okay, who has... Is he the one who just moved? Oh. As an empire of great power, it's only appropriate for the Onyx Hive to receive tribute from the Iridium Corporation. Hmm. He wants me to give him 67 credits a week? Hit the road. Yeah, What? what is he thinking? Uh... Okay, they still like me, but faction power third. I'm first. They've got... Ooh, they actually do outrank me in military power. Okay, I need to quit screwing around, and uh, I need to get my military up and running. In the meanwhile, let's send these guys down here. What is that? An interceptor. Yeah, let's just take it out. I just want to keep eliminating any of their ships. Take a world. Okay, I can do that. Done. Nice. What kind of world is this? Not a very good one. Okay. Population, wealth. 
Harmony Crystal Extractor. Okay, I'm just gonna set this one up as a wealth as a wealth builder. He can terraform. I don't think they do a very good job of this, uh, but the game's not that hard. I'm playing on normal mode. It it's, it seems a little more fair to let them try to do it instead of me. All right, let's take that turn to do this acquisitions. Increase my starbase range. Shipyard idle. Okay, here. Where's that starbase? I've got this guy coming down here to get those. These are unclaimed. That is claimed. This is unclaimed. Let's take that guy out. Okay. Move those guys up there. Is this mine? Yeah. Treasury. 15%, oh, 15% research boost to something that I thought I was going to be able to beat in one turn, it said. Hmm, maybe that just didn't work quite right. The uh, tooltip might be bugged. Oh yeah, there goes one turn now. Let's see, I like this approval relic. It might be worth spending one guy just on that. Let me see what else is worth mining here. Am I missing anything? One thulium there, not worth very much. All right, let's go, and I've got a guy coming here to get those. So let's just come down here to get this approval relic and then put a little more coverage uh, when it comes. I'll put it like here, and then maybe I can provide some support to these worlds and gather that. Okay, so he's gonna be quite a ways off. I think now it's time to start building hypergates. Yeah. Actually, now I think it's time to build gunships. All right, let's see. Should I do the gunboats or the... Let's go with the gunboat. Okay. Shipyard idle. Who's this? Androman. Where are they? Okay, I'm gonna have actually I'm gonna have these guys build a stellar architect. And I'm gonna have these guys also build one. See if we can get these to link up. That would be a good boost. And if I could get one up here too, that would also be nice. Idle ship, what is it? Possibility engine? Where? Okay, that's already claimed. That's claimed. What can I build? Come out up here and start taking these things. Is somebody claiming these? No. All right. Well, let's send them up here. Okay. And then what are they building now? I'll have them build an architect. Okay. And then I'll put another star base up here near Drath. Or uh, over here, I guess. Okay. Idle ship. Keep exploring. Idle ship. I'm going to have this guy meet up with this fleet. This is my uh, big fleet with all of my legions. It's got 10 legions. So I've only got five up here. I can't afford to lose them. Take out that capsule. All right. Okay, so we're looking at 35 minutes on this session, so we're gonna be wrapping up pretty soon. Uh, but I think when we come back, we're finally gonna get our hyperspace set up linked in, which will be nice. Let's see how many, I still only have one, one ascension crystal. Oh, okay, so I'm not actually researching that yet. Well, there's another thing I need to do then. Oh, or mining any of these. Okay, so I do still need a lot more mining ships. All right, got that starbase range. Okay, let's see. Improves the quality of our weapon systems. I assume that these are only on star bases though. Hit points of our ships, is it for everything? Well, if that's the case, I'm gonna go with 
all weapons increased by 5% for only two turns. That's a pretty good research. Is that my ship? Where's he going? Where are they going? Oh, that ship that they were targeting is flying out there. Okay, let's pull him back. I don't want to make anybody mad by being in their space. All right, let's bring this guy back too. We're getting a little far out. All right. What did I get here? A gunboat. Bring him over here. Got it. Okay. Excellent. I'm happy about that. All right. Now what should I start researching? Hmm. Hull repair. You know, I'm going to go with, with this. Minimize one more time. Or can I do... I don't think I can do large ships yet. Let me check. Trade. Okay, I only have three licenses left. I'm doing pretty good now, though. Do I have it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got eight ones used with... Is this the only one that's... Oh, no, I've got two and two. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. I have trade relationships with six cultures. Two, three, four, five, six. So who am I not trading with? Oh, just the draft who I'm at war with. Okay. So I think I'm actually pretty good there. So I don't think I need to work on diplomacy research or uh, more trade licenses. I'm happy to get more trade licenses. Um, let me go with mining. Governance. 10% production. I'm going to go with that. That's a good one. All right. Go with that. Shipyard idle. Who is it? Oh, these guys. Are they not... They're not mining... Not mining that. Would it be worth dropping a ship here just to get that one? I could send him down here, but he's going to take so long to fly that I think an, another ship will be able to get there beforehand. All right, let's bring this guy here. I'm just going to use him to build a uh, star base to try to mine this and possibly support these. Let's see what it can do. Mining ring. Oh, no, that's military. Let's do economic ring. Yeah, let's have him support those two worlds. And then factory, market. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. Let's see. Yeah, they'll, he'll work on those. Unfortunately, I can't make it a mining ship. It doesn't look like. Uh, but th that's all right. Let's give it perimeter scanners. Give it a little bit more range. And then I believe that there's a specialization that allows you to boost the trade routes also. So I'll put all that on there. Uh, okay, so I think that's going to wrap up this episode. Here's a look at the map um, from as far out as we can zoom it. It's actually looking pretty darn good. Um, we definitely have a large portion of the galaxy under our control. We are still lagging militarily. As soon as I get these three hypergates up, I'm just going to kick everything into high gear when it comes to mining. Um, or to military manufacturing, give me a chance to get the ships spread out um, so I can kind of put them where I need them. And then I think once I take these two worlds, I'll be I'll be doing a lot better. Um, who are my actual military military rivals? Military power. Okay, so there's me in third. Oh wait, am I in first? Oh no, there I am. I'm in third currently behind the Altarians and the Onyx Hive. Okay, so both of those guys like me, so I think I'm okay there, but I really need to push up. The Drangan are catching up. Everybody else is kind of getting down here. The Drath are nothing, so I'm going to be able to take them out, and then I'll be able to use all of their worlds to help get my empire going. I'm going to need a lot more Hypergates to cover this whole space. Um, all right, let me save it right there. That's the end of episode 11. Thank you guys for uh, joining me this time. I really appreciate it. Please leave a comment if you think I missed anything or if there's anything that you want me to focus on. And I'll make sure I start working on that in uh, future episodes. Have a great day.